I do want to read you this headline and see what you think. Okay, so I'm, this is a true headline. I'm not making this up. Uh, <clears throat> and this is from CNN. Okay. All right, quote unquote, college student on a trip to the Ozarks fell 100 feet to her death while posing for a photo. What? What do you make of that headline there? When was this? This was some time ago. Uh, a little more details here. Witnesses said she repositioned herself for a photo and then fell. 61 emergency personnel responded to the scene and she lost her footing before she fell approximately 100 feet. Who was the photographer? Who allowed her to get so close to the edge like that? That's sad. I don't have the full article in front of me. I just took a little excerpt out of it. But uh, just curious, have you ever had an accident or almost died for a photo? I wouldn't go to that extreme. No. Um, I mean, I'm accident prone, so just walking down like my pier or something, I'd be twisting my ankle and I'd fall and buzz my butt and get a splinter. But other than that, mm -mm, no. That's really sad. I hate to hear that. Now, just being on your phone, um, have you ever had an act, because you are accident prone, like you said, have you ever been looking in your phone, like texting, looking in your phone and walking and almost had an accident? Yeah, I've run into a couple telephone poles. <laughs> you have. I have. Yeah, and trash cans that they have on sidewalks. Oh, yeah. I, sometimes I like, I thought this other lady was my mom. And I was like, hey, mom, and it wasn't my mom. So it was kind of frightening. Mm. Uh, You've yeah. hurt yourself uh, with the telephone pole? Oh, yeah, because it's like head first, you know. Uh, and I have like a big old goose egg. <laughs> so, yeah, you know, I, I'll be getting hurt just by not paying attention. But What about driving, texting, driving, using your <clears throat> phone while driving? Have you ever had an accident doing that before? No. Um, I can't deny that I have never texted and drive, um, but I don't do that anymore. I highly recommend do not text and drive. Um, but no, I I'm scared of that. The only thing like I'll do is like I might like grab my phone and like change a song real quick, but that's it. And the reason why you don't uh, drive, I mean, the reason why you don't uh text and drive or fiddle on your phone in that manner is because you've had a scare before? You've had a, an almost situation happen or? I actually saw this commercial one time where this woman was texting and driving and she had her kids in the back and everyone just died. And it was such an awful commercial and it just brought me to tears. And it's not just you that you're being selfish about like your own life, you're being selfish when it comes to other people's lives and so I don't I don't want to risk it like that. And you saw a commercial but stuff like that happens in real life. Absolutely. People have died from from this sort of thing before. Right.